Hi, my name is Chef Jim Rhodes. I'm the owner of Chef's Deli and More on Hoosick Street in Troy. Uh, today we're going to show you how to keep your broccoli in a nice bright green color, even if you use it for salads, um, and a couple of tricks on how to have it cook evenly so that stalks finish cooking at the same time the flower end of it does and the bud end, okay? The first thing we want to do is, I'm going to demonstrate how to do it for a salad so it's good and cold and it doesn't overcook but it has a bright green color because by the time when you add hot water or you cook broccoli the water itself creates the chlorophyll to bloom in the broccoli and that's what gives it the bright green color the thing you have to remember when you do this it's a quick process so what we're going to do is we're going to take our broccoli and we're going to use this strictly for salads and here's our ice water so what you're going to need is boiling water ice water and you're going to need a, a slotted spoon or what we call a spider because what we're going to do is we're going to drop the broccoli in we're going to count to three we're going to take it out of there and we're going to drop it here real quick that way there won't be any cooking done it'll just develop the chlorofilter in it and so what we're going to do is take our broccoli we're going to drop it in we're going to go one two three we're going to take it out and we're going to blanch it real quick in ice water and now what we do is we end up with broccoli that's that nice bright green, green color as opposed to the dull green and it's not cooked so now I can take this and I can cut it into florets just like that so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take this I'm going to cut it into small florets and then I can use this in salads in crudités or where I want raw broccoli because the broccoli itself isn't cooked. It, has, it still has its nice crisp flavor and taste to it. And it has that, now has the bright green color as opposed to that dull color, okay? The other thing we want to do is when we're cooking broccoli from a raw state and we want it to cook at the same temperature, what we do is we take our broccoli and we trim the ends of our florets off. And then we put an X in the bottom of our florets about a quarter of the way down on the thickness of the, the floret, just like this. And then when you cook them in the boiling water, the stalks will cook at the same time as the floret does. And that way there you'll have a nice flavor and even cooking all the way through. And that's just the process of doing it. So the other thing we want to do is we want the broccoli to stay nice and green when we cook it as opposed to that gray color. Now this is a trick that I learned 35, 40 years ago that we don't use anymore because what it does do is it breaks down the fiber of the broccoli. But if you do it quickly, it won't. So the first thing we do, and this is the secret, cooking by chemicals, okay? We take a touch of baking soda and we drop it in our boiling water, just a little pinch of it, okay? Then what we do is we take our broccoli after we vex the, the, the stalks on it, okay? and we drop that into boiling water. Now we let it cook until we, it's the tenderness that we want and it's finished. But what that'll do, it will never change color because the baking soda will act again as a chemical reaction to the chlorophyll in the broccoli and keep it green. And this way here, the, the, it won't turn that gray color that you get sometimes with cooked broccoli. And it works much better so that if you want that color on a nice plate, so that you don't lose that nice green color, you'll see it stays that nice green, cooks evenly because of the X in the bottom of the broccoli, and it has a much greener color than the dull broccoli, and it will cook evenly through the whole thing, the stalks and the flowers cooking at the same time. And that's how you keep broccoli nice and green, fresh, ice cold if you want it for your salads, nice and crispy, not even cooked at all, okay? And nice and green and evenly cooked, as opposed to the stalks being hard and crunchy and the florets being soft and tender. And that way you can use them without having to worry about them being a dull green.